Want to know how to light up a bulb without wires? Hello everyone, today we are going to turn this $10 Facebook Marketplace microwave into a real life ray gun. We got these light bulbs from Home Depot and we're going to use these to demonstrate how we're going to light these up wirelessly using the photons shot out from this microwave. All right, so this is a basic overview of what we're gonna be using for our ray gun. We have our 120 volt input, and we're gonna pass that through a noise filter, which keeps uh, high frequencies from traveling up into our microwave system and vice versa. Uh, so after that, we have it passed to our transformer, which steps up our voltage from 120 to 2000. From there, we uh, then step it up again to 5000 volts using our high voltage capacitor. And then that we directly feed into our magnetron. And our magnetron is what makes all the magic happen and basically is what creates the high frequency microwaves. All right, so this is going to be our subframe that we're going to use. We're going to have everything mounted like this. I'm going to put a panel on the bottom, and then we're going to have a frame up top with some handles so we can actually direct it. All right, we finished the frame, and now we're going to cut this bottom plate and put it on the bottom to mount all of our components on. All right, we are gonna add some length to these two wires for them to reach the magnetron. And then from there, we're gonna wire up a switch for our trigger, and then it will be almost finished. This is what we have so far. We got the frame pretty much put together. Uh, we have all the circuitry mounted, and now we just have to put on our, our direction coupler and our trigger, and then we will be ready to go. Gotcha. My bad, made a cameo. <laughs> Landon has finished his design here. And although it is close to perfect, it was not made perfect without my contribution of these zip ties. So I just want to make sure that that is clear. Um, but yes, no, the rest of it was him. Getting ready for test one, what are you, what are you showing us? I'm going to show you guys, we're, we're going to be retrofitting some safety goggles out of this uh, microwave mesh. That we took this directly from the screen of the microwave door. And this basically acts as a Faraday cage to prevent microwaves from passing through. That's stylish. That's safety as a virtue. <laughs> All right, guys, we have completed our build here and we're just getting ready to test it. I have built some safety glasses here so I don't give myself cataracts. And if you like this build, subscribe, like, share for more so we can build a lot more cool experiments and do a lot of cool, more fun stuff. All With right. that being said, check this out. Let's check it out. Oh, that's so cool. Let me help anybody who is doubting with questions. These lights are still in the package. There's no cables, nothing around here. Um, we should actually take these out and set them up really cool, but yes, if you've ever wondered how to test your light bulbs, if they work while still in the package, you just have to call us up. <laughs> we will help you with that. We are exploring additional use cases to our machine. And here we have a computer. So POV, it is 2008. You are Edward Snowden and you need to instantly get rid of your files on your Red Hot Linux. Did it do anything? Is it off? It's completely off. 
POV, you find yourself in a forest, but you have a microwave ray gun and you need to heat up your Subway sandwich. Mmm. That's good. All right, guys. This is the final build. We hope you guys like it, lighting up that light bulb. Please let us know if there are any other things you'd like to see us try to light up or any other experiments. Do leave that in the comments below. Um, this was our only microwave. We sacrificed it for the greater good mm -hmm. and for the lab. So yes, tell them about the plasma video. We made a video about a plasma arc that could play music using your phone. And yes. it is really cool if you want to check it out. Until then, see you guys in the next video. Bye.